Hello everyone, welcome to How to Browse Your Channel. In this video, I'm going to be showing you how to fix Modern Warfare 2 loading screen. So let's jump right into the video without wasting any second. So in this video, I'll do my best to help you fix this problem. And if it still doesn't work, please let me know in the comment section down below for the ways to fix this problem. Because I'm trying my best to help you fix Because I know it's very annoying when you're trying to have some fun, but this really stays in your way. Okay, so let's jump right into the video. Press on your keyboard, Windows logo key plus S and here write battle.net okay now now go to the game modern warfare and now i don't have the game so i'll show you for a normal game it doesn't really matter so i'll show you for a game that i have okay go to the game and then click on options and here please select scan and repair and once you've done that, now let's move to the next method to fix this annoying problem issue. Now go to Call of Duty Modern Warfare um, 2 and right click on, um, so just right click on the game and select uh, properties. And then here you will, you'll see, now if you don't know where the game is located, the file what you have to do is just go to steam and right click and select properties and then go to local files and then browse and here you're gonna see the where Call of Duty is located and then right right click and select properties and here in compatibility please okay and now what you have to do is to check run this program in compatibility mode for Windows Eight, and then please check disable full screen optimizations and please check run this program as administrator apply and OK and now let me show you the next method now it's here in the search bar please write allow and app true windows firewall click on it and here click on change settings and look for Call of Duty and then check this too it's very important Okay, the next is to write in the search bar G force experience and click on it and here please go to the game go to details and here please click on this button you'll see oh, you'll see over here and once you've done that you also have to click on the one second to wait okay this one click on optimize and then once you've done that once you click on optimize select uh, or click on custom settings and here please change from full screen to win windows uh, borderless instead of windows borderless and you see if this is some problem we can you, you can go back to full screen and also here um, select performance and apply also guys go to right click in the video control panel and here wait a couple of seconds and also please here select uh, if it's quality for you please select performance and uh, here manage 3d settings in um, here you should also go to Windows graphic settings and here browse select COD add and uh, it's already here and here please click on options and then high performance so we have the RTX this uh, GPU set off here high performance save it's very important as well and apply okay now let's go back to steam and here right click properties and here please uh, uncheck enable the steam overlay while in the game please do this and also write this as well please do so and also let's go back to local files and here click verify integrity of game files if there's any files uh, missing um, inside the location of this game if there's any files problems with the files if you click on this button it will um, solve any issues 
regardless to the way the files are managed and are yeah managed so please do so click on verify integrity of the game files and now let me show you the next method please uh, right press in windows s and uh, here please write device manager and here in device manager please go to displays adapters and update the disk driver and uh, also install the nvidia or what uh, gpu you have or driver you need for your laptop computer uh, i have uh, an nvidia and geforce uh, so please go to it and uh, just go to drivers and here select that is game ready driver and seems like there's a driver uh, some updates available so just click on download need to go to the official website and in here this is the official website click on download obviously you have to select here you can also uh, select the uh, download type I read somewhere is actually studio drivers are more optimized instead of using the initial game ready driver for obviously games here please select the product uh, and uh, the your 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 graphic card and uh, start search and then click on download or you can click uh, right beforehand just right away just click on download now and they will the software will automatically um, find your driver and will update your driver directly so now also please uh, here in the search bar please write windows updates check for updates and here please click on this button check for updates and also the next uh, method is uh, to simply go to this website and here please uh, install DirectX and user runtime web installer click on download and uh, we need to install this yes accept next no uncheck this install I already installed this so I'll just cancel the installation are you sure on to click yes okay and also go please go to this website I'll leave the uh, the links for this website in the description of this video and click on uh, mm, on this options like which one you need if is X 86 I have 68 I'll select this one save and then install this as well also please it's very important right click on the taskbar and select task manager and here go to startup and here just select apps that you don't need to run in the background and select them and then click on um, on disable button it's very will increase the performance and also here in the search bar please uh, it's very important as well if you're using Windows 10 here write background apps and uh, here please turn off background apps that can cause problems with your connection with your ping with your performance some of them take uh, data a lot of connection a lot of data and, and, and they will decrease the speed of your internet connection and also the, the, the performance on your the performance in the game so please click on this button and turn off uh, let apps run in the background we don't need this okay in the last method uh, windows logo 3 plus s and here write cmd and i'm sorry i forgot to run it as administrator cmd right click run as administrator and here please write c slash com and enter enter okay so these are the methods I found and uh, some of them actually uh, I, I used them to fix uh, my problems um, that has that I that I had in the game while I was playing 
I encountered those errors so I tested all those methods actually some of them don't work so please try all of them and see which one will work for you guys thank you for watching this video don't forget to subscribe for more tutorials I really appreciate it if, if this video helped you out don't forget to, to like this video thank you guys for watching and I'll see you in the next tutorial take care